Our next guests are celebrity authors and healthy food ambassadors delivering delicious, great tasting recipes that are actually good for you in their new book, Love on a Plate, the Gourmet Uncookbook. Today we learn how to make freezer chocolate. We welcome Kara Brotman and Marcus Rothkranz to Virginia this morning. It's nice to have both of you here. It's a pleasure to be here. You guys, A, have so much energy. I've been watching you all morning buzzing around like little <laughs> hummingbirds over here getting all this together. And a big part of that is because of the what you're food. sharing here yeah. and that healthy food. That's right. Um, uh, the whole secret here is to not heat your food over 118 degrees. So everything we make, which is all copies of our favorite junk food that we love, the, the, the pop tarts, the creme brulee, the chocolate, but we do it in a healthy way where there's no dairy, no animal products, no sugar, no heating over 118 However, degrees. it tastes delicious. Tastes delicious. delicious. We're not yeah. compromising flavor in the slightest so, bit. Yeah. Oftentimes better than the real thing. Yeah, really, because it's cleaner food. Yeah. That's Clean. right. And this That's chocolate right. here, uh, everybody loves chocolate, and it, this is the easiest way to get someone to hooked into this lifestyle. I have a whole freezer full of this at home. And I, anybody comes in and, and, and they say, how come you guys stay young? How come you guys like aren't aging or anything? I give them a piece of this, and they go, Wow, by I thought, eating chocolate? They go, I thought jo <laughs> I, I thought eating healthy was carrot sticks and celery. No, you can eat this stuff. Well, hook hook us this morning, Mark. Right. Show us how it's this done. This is so easy. Like the, the the reason normal chocolate is bad for you is hydrogenated fats. Clogs your arteries, gives you heart attacks, bad for you. And it's got sugar and dairy and all that other stuff. This is all you need to make the chocolate. It's These are very natural purest ingredients. The purest yeah. chocolate, the purest cacao. And so so here, here's the ingredients. This is, this is all, you, all you do is mix these in a bowl and you're done. Uh, this is raw cacao powder. This is just pure chocolate in its more natural state. Carob bean, which is another type of chocolate flavored bean that grows on a tree. Mm -hmm. Here we have cashew butter. Now this is the secret. This right here is what makes this whole recipe. This is uh, coconut oil. Coconut oil gets hard below 76 degrees mm -hmm. Fahrenheit, but it goes liquid, as you can see here, like water. It's clear as water. I thought you were going to say the secret is water. The secret, yeah. okay, is yeah. coconut oil. No, no. <laughs> the, the, this is actually coconut oil. It looks like water when it's over 77 degrees. Here you can see it starting to get, see, it's still liquid, but it's starting to solidify crust a little up bit, a little bit yeah. because we're right on that edge there. Now, w it, this is why we call it freezer chocolate. We keep it in the freezer so it gets hard. Mm -hmm. uh, so it's like chocolate. You take it out, you've got like maybe 20 minutes to eat it, but then it starts to melt. When it gets inside your body, which is 98.6, it's liquid. So it never gets hard, it never clogs your arteries, and it's good for you. There's healthy fats and bad fats. And then we have maple syrup and a little bit of vanilla. Okay. Mix it together in a bowl, looks like this. All of these seem very approachable, Marcus. And, and Kara, these things are probably more available than ever. I yeah. mean, at your regular grocery store. Nowadays, yeah, they are. Yeah. And you can order this, it online. This is becoming more mainstream. And uh, online is a really good source for a lot of these ingredients as well. Now, our, in our special treat here, we put some marzipan in there. She's going to show you how easy it is mar marzipan. Marzipan is just basically, this is almond powder. Put it in there. And then a little maple syrup. I've heard of marzipan, but I've never made it before. Well, European. this is healthy marzipan. Oh, yeah. Again, and then you just them. stir it up. And then, you know, after we stir it well, mm -hmm. we get these hard balls, mm -hmm. just form it into a ball, and then we just stick it inside the chocolate. Okay. So what we do is So that's is we, treat number B right. in the so whole we, treat yeah. plan. <laughs> so, we, so we get these little paper cups, we take the chocolate, pour it in there, put one of those on top. And then smush it in. And then we put oh, it in. Oh, oh, it's okay. Uh, perfect. Hey, a hole in one. <laughs> Did we get, oh, That geez. is great. So then we put that in the freezer, and five minutes later, you've got this rock hard chocolate. You gotta try one. Go okay, ahead. Okay, I'm gonna for do. It. I'm gonna go for it. <laughs> I'm still, I'm still really excited about that hole in one. Okay, they are cold. <laughs> you can see it looks like uh, just like a regular piece of chocolate. And you can I can already feel it starting in my warm hands. To and you, uh, can, you can fill it with uh, peanut butter. Make Reese's like oh, yeah. the peanut butter cups or something. Mm. Oh boy. Woo, you would definitely hook them with this because that's a delightful treat and super easy to make. So yeah. you just put these together. And not only that, it's super healthy. I wouldn't mind giving my kids something like this and not worry about them having a sugar you know, rush mm -hmm. or get being, getting overweight. You know what, this is protein. This is a meal. This is actually good for them. You can eat this as a meal. All I'm the not... desserts in this book are actually so good for you and they taste so good and mm -hmm. you can give your kid this for dinner. Right, <laughs> right. This and tastes, know that they're eating well. This tastes delicious. A lot of folks watching today may say, okay, wait a second raw food, we're not cooking it over a certain 
you know, this is complicated. And then ultimately, is it going to taste like what I want it to taste right. like? But these recipes you've made so approachable, and this tastes dynamite. This is fantastic. It's like it's like gourmet chocolate. I, I come from a family of gourmet chefs. It's in my blood. So a lot of these recipes, you know, have this gourmet flair. They taste wonderful. I can't compromise taste with my food. No, and you both are a living testament to this because you have so much energy. You're really feeling well after you made this change. You didn't all you you were not always this no, way, Marcus. No, I'm, I'm 50. And I look better and feel better now than I did when I was in my 20s when I was dying and eating just a standard American diet. I never drank, never smoked, never did drugs, never even did coffee or alcohol. And I was sick and dying because I was eating bread, pastas, white milk, sugar. But I can't give up this stuff. I love it. Right. You know, so I had to find out ways to keep eating the food I love but healthy versions of it, which is why we created this. And your fans must just be super excited when they get to interact with you after they've tried this. And it oh, really yeah. does. How quickly does life start to change? Maybe when you make. Some of well, these. I think the first thing is the excitement that there is an alternative, that there is, and it's easy. And the, also the excitement is that, oh my God, it tastes so good. It yeah. does. That is what the excitement is, that you don't have to compromise taste in order to eat healthy. Mm -hmm. And it's fast and easy. Well, you guys did a great job. This is fantastic. Available on Amazon. Thanks for being well, with well us. As well as healthycookbook.com. Okay, yeah. great. <laughs> on your site. That's right. You, yeah. you mentioned there's a little bit of a price benefit there. Love on a Plate, the Gourmet Uncookbook is now available. Be sure to check it out. Thank you both for coming in oh, today. You're so welcome. A revolutionary a way of eating and having your cake too.